Hi, thanks for watching my video. I'm going to make a quick video here and explain something about a Lua trigger that someone asked me. If I could show how to make a Lua trigger to set a car on fire. And you can see I put some decals on this car. It's pretty cool. Anyways, I'm going to go down here and we're going to put a Lua trigger right here, F11. This is very easy to do. And click on the little create object and create a Lua. I'm going to resize this so that when the car jumps through it, whoops, make it kind of tall. There we go. That's good. Okay. Now I'm going to bring this over here. And this is the script. Don't pay any attention to all of this nonsense up here. This is a language for AI. I've been really messing around with a lot of AI stuff lately. <clears throat> what we're interested in is this right here, which I'm going to put a copy of this down in the description. So we'll just hit Control C and copy that. Come back to our Lua and come over here to where it says Lua function. Click on that little box. And this little box over here will pop up. Put your cursor, Control V for paste. Click OK. <clears throat> now, what I like to do, you don't have to do this, but I always do Control S, level save, wait for that to finish. And then I always go to edit and rebuild collision. All right, let's go back to our vehicle. All right, now I'm going to set this vehicle to chase. And you can't see it, but there's another car way down there. And there you go. It's as easy as that. So I'll go over it one more time really quick. <clears throat> go to the plus, click on BeamMG, click on Lua, put your Lua down there, and come over to Lua function. Bring that up, go down in the description, and you would just copy this and then paste it into this location, and that's it. And you drive through there, and your vehicle should... Uh, catch fire. If you have any questions, just leave it down in the comments if you have any problems or if it doesn't work. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.